Hello YouTube, my name is Hero, and today we're going to be discussing some new things that's going on with Black Desert, but before we start, I just want to uh, take a couple seconds to talk about a video that I uploaded yesterday. Um, it was about the new uh, Second Awakenings, which uh, shouldn't be called Second Awakenings anymore. We have to come up with a new name for that, but basically I made a trailer analysis for it, and I'll admit that the trailer analysis wasn't my best work i should have called it more of a trailer reaction trailer review trailer thoughts something like that rather than analysis analysis is a word that was maybe a little too uh a little too much over the top of what i was capable of doing for that video considering that i didn't know any of the skills of the classes and obviously i could have researched the skills but me knowing in black desert that x skill does x the, the amount of damage or cc doesn't mean i know it's going to be good or useful there are tons of skills that do cc and stuff like that that people never use so i wouldn't have been able to speak on it even if i had have known exactly what the skill was so and i should have just called it and um instead of an analysis i should have called it a trailer review something like that i think that would have been a lot more in line with what i was uh, able to talk about in that video so in the future I will be sure to remember uh, to keep in mind what the titles are and make sure that I correlate the titles a little bit better with my videos and I do want to thank the people that left constructive criticism on that video for me I do appreciate that and I will take all of that into consideration as I continue to grow thank you guys for that and for now let's get into the video now a lot of people are asking me how i feel about warrior super armor being gone on the new test server that just um released a new version of the test server basically if you guys don't know what the test server is it's basically a server where pvp and a lot of pvp things are going to be changing i made videos about this in the past but it's been so long now i guess i should refresh you guys on it um, and not only that and remind you that they've been testing this server for a very long time they've even given it a name it's called the it's called Arsha server, which is the arena of Arsha, Asha, sorry, I'm sorry if I'm not pronouncing that right, whatever. So the new server is, uh, the new server is, is PVP oriented and is there's no mobs and pretty much what people do is they just go in there to test the new PVP settings. Now, the main things to take away from these new settings is the DP values increase dramatically and when you get knocked down, you can block for uh, a certain amount of time you get a block just like if you were blocking you know you get a block shield and everything and you just lay on the ground and block and um that's and uh you hold space bar and uh that just gives you a block now uh the 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 other big thing is that the cc of the server has been changed for the people who don't know what cc is cc is crowd control so basically when you knock someone down when you grab them when you float them all that stuff you can do it you can do three different cc's and after the third they get super armor to all cc's so your combo has to be restricted to three different cc types which is very 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 hard if you really think about it at first i thought it was going to be three of the same cc for example you can't do more than three grabs or you can't do more than three down smashes something like that but it looks like that's not going to be the case it looks like this is going to be a flat out three cc's so it's going to be interesting to see how people organize their combos now enough backstory on that we're going to go into this video now the video showcases a warrior who uses his block and as you guys should know when warrior blocks he receives super armor while blocking and lingering super armor which remains on him after he gets done blocking for three seconds that is now gone on this server and people are saying warriors dead warriors dead reroll i'm selling my dandy it's over and i'm like okay let's not get carried away first of all nothing on this test server is finalized they could change it back just as easily as they've taken it off second of all we have no idea when this test server is going to come and third and most importantly if this change does remain there are definitely going to be changes to other classes i have no doubt in my mind about that 
that will make this change a lot more reasonable. As it stands right now, Warrior does need the super armor in order to compete with other classes. The game has been pretty much balanced around that at this point. However, and this new server it may not be the case as i've been told that sorks have received various different nerfs to their cc capabilities even though they didn't have much i'm sure other classes will receive the same now the the big question is how will warriors play now without super armor the, the, the truth is you're just gonna have to start getting used to it if we don't not a lot of classes other classes don't have super armor so it doesn't make sense that warriors should have it up all the freaking time I, i've always been a big uh a big kind of not a fan of the lingering super armor i never really was on the side of that i always thought it was kind of dumb that we could just block and then have super armor for three seconds i think super armor while blocking is fine but i think blocking after or having super armor after blocking is just kind of ridiculous so i understand why they're taking it out and if they find a way to make to make it fair and make it reasonable for all the other players especially if they're going to be nerfing now which is really kind of odd because as we know they've said that they don't want to nerf classes that they want classes to be buffed to keep up with dark knight but this is clearly a nerf to warrior so i wonder what other kind of nerfs we're going to be seeing uh, there should definitely be some nerfs to witch and wizard there should definitely be some nerfs to um dark knight if there's going to be a nerf to warrior i'm pretty sure everyone can agree with me on that uh, so we're just going to have to wait and see what they do more with this server. Uh, it's really hard to say right now whether or not this is a great thing or a terrible thing. But I just want all the Warriors to calm the hell down and everyone else to calm the hell down because we don't know what this server is going to be. Um, but I just really, I seriously can't wait to see what it's going to be. I'm very excited and uh, hope you guys are too. I'll keep you guys updated on this. Once again, thanks for watching. It's your boy Hero. See you guys next time. Peace.